going out of business. All of them. I know you fucking lying. <laughs> Michaels is buying some of them. So, um, I just wanted to come and do something quick and simple because Vlogmas is hard as hell. So I have a really simple DIY for your crusty ass lips and it literally only involves two things and that is brown sugar and coconut oil. This isn't just for your lips though. It can be a um, complete scrub for your whole body. All you need to do, take a sport because who has real somewhere, scoop a couple scoops of brown sugar. You can do this with regular sugar too and you can do it with different kinds of oils. Um, but I like coconut oil because I think it helps the um, stick everything together better. So this is enough. I put it in a um, Tupperware so I can keep it for longer. You don't need that much. So probably just do it. It's the ratio of three to one. You want a gritty put together texture. So you don't want nothing that's too smooth. I say let your um, coconut oil um, warm up a little bit. The way I test if it's good. So just take a little bit. If it breaks up really good, but like they're still clump, like it's still clumpy together. It's not, the texture is not going to be too runny, but it's going to clump together. So, this is the texture. I'll say it should be. And then you just can literally scrub this on your body. Take a little bit. And ultimately, you can lick it off because it is edible. So, I have a little hack. If you put on lip balm, I prefer liquid, but I can't find one right now. Um... If you put on a little lip balm before you put on your um, gloss, it'll last longer. Already, and with the sugar scrub, like you can put it on your hands. Like I know my hands get cracked and dry. Um, you can just scrub it on your hands, wash it off. But that's how you get really kissable lips during colder months. You just scrub lip balm and lip gloss and you'll have the perfect gloss every time i promise so thank you for watching thank you for loving happy vlogmas until next time okay bye